Welcome to the AI Guide, where we focus on the human impact of AI. For us to understand how AI will have a major human impact, we really need to know where it is going. Two stories tell us what's happening right now. First, major AI players are preparing for bigger models that are more powerful and can finally solve really hard practical problems. Here's a great example. Tesla plans an 85,000 H100 cluster. That's 85,000 H100 chips. Facebook still has the largest publicly disclosed cluster. Tesla has around 35,000 NVIDIA H100 chips today and is scaling to 85,000 by the end of the year, according to Elon Musk on a recent conference call. By comparison, Facebook is targeting 350,000 H100s by the end of the year. Regardless of the scale difference, Tesla's plan to build out still represents more than a billion dollars in compute capex for the year. And that assumes massive discounts off the retail H100 price of 35 to 40,000 each. Why does this matter? AI is more like heavy machinery than SaaS, software as a service. AI businesses are much more capital intensive, heavy machinery companies than software as a service businesses. So rather than being a rounding error, the compute represents the vast majority of the investment outlay to unlock new products and services. In Tesla case, this is self-driving cars. And in Facebook's case, this is chatbots and image generators and VR services. So that's the first story. Next, AI is also getting smaller, pushing toward being on small devices like your phone instead of using the cloud for computing. We have already talked about the push to a system on a chip. This is another great example, the smaller model. So Microsoft has come up with the Phi 3 Mini AI model for local PC integration. So this is AI on a PC. Microsoft recently introduced Phi 3 Mini, a 3.8 billion parameter language model compared to trillions for the major models designed to run on local devices. The new paper hints at the potential for a local version of Copilot. This local version can run on PCs, providing a cheaper alternative to cloud-powered LLMs. Though Microsoft hasn't confirmed Phi 3 Mini as the next Copilot, the potential for local PC integration is clear. The model's innovation lies in its training data set responses close to large models while maintaining the efficiency of a smaller model. This development has substantial implications, particularly for organizations seeking on-premise AI capabilities rather than cloud. For individuals concerned about privacy and sensitive data leakage. So as you can see here, AI is moving in two opposite directions at the same time. So what does that really mean? It means that AI will literally be everywhere by either solving big problems in the cloud clusters or solving small problems on your device. So buckle your seatbelt, folks. If you like this episode, please like, subscribe, and share. Also, please support us on Patreon. Really appreciate your support. Thanks so much. We'll see you next time. Take care. Bye.